It was an afternoon of networking in Power City. As the oil and gas industry booms in Southeast Texas, everyone is looking to get in on the action. Today, hundreds of contractors gathered at the Bob Bauer Civic Center in Port Arthur for the seventh annual Port Arthur Industry Expo. Vendors got to meet with refinery reps and learn more about how they can collaborate. Vendors got to show off some cool new technology as well that could help the oil and gas industry thrive in our area. And right now we know there's pretty intense competition. 12 News reporter Ebony Coleman is here tonight. Ebony officials say every year this event just gets bigger. Hey guys, the Port Arthur Chamber of Commerce hosted the event. They tell me that Southeast Texas is the hottest region in North America for the petrochemical industry. And with wall to wall vendors and a large crowd at today's expo, I got a taste of just how hot it is. I've spoken to, I don't, I don't know, maybe 25, 30 businesses, and, and there's still several, several more to go. <laughs> Bunny McMillan Rivier is a marketer for BMAX Inc. Productions in Beaumont. Her company works with multiple oil and gas companies in Southeast Texas. She came to the Industry Expo to see the latest industry products. There is such a wide array of, of things out there from from uh, nuts and bolts and safety to medical. This is just our demo. Um, so this is a simple pipe loop. And um, we everything that's pictured here from the 90s to the flange. But products are just one feature that about 700 contractors and attendees like Bonnie got to experience. They also got to network. We've got $171 billion with a B in business breaking loose between Beaumont and Lake Charles and 115,000 people need it. Chairman of the Port Arthur Business Group, Travis Woods, says when a company is looking to work with a refinery, putting a face to the name is beneficial. Folks can walk up and say, here's my business card. I'm John Doe and, and I own XYZ Electric. How do I do business with y'all? Randy Sonier actually works for one of the refineries, Total Energies. He says all around the event was a success. If we're hiring for 25 people, we may have three or 4,000 applications. So these third parties basically come down and say, okay, based on their criteria and their background, here's 200 we recommend. And then we start doing face-to-face -face interviews. So it's a great event. Wood says this event also gives refineries a chance to hire local suppliers and contractors. In studio, Ebony Coleman, 12 News.